hi guys this is Tomo Adebanjo and this is a wash day routine video you see how dry and crusty my hair is Ew. yeah we're going to be switching to this real soon so if this is something you'd like to see then please keep watching and of course subscribe to my channel i like this video <laughs> So today's wash day is pretty much a mix and match of different brands and different products. So first of all, I take two different conditioners. One is the Bell Star conditioner and then the other is the Ziza the Cap Leave-In conditioner. I had a little leftover in the bottle. So I just mix both conditioners with some water to make my very own detangling spray. And now I'm just sectioning my hair. I think I did four sections and each of those four sections I split in two. Now I'm just spritzing the detangling spray all over that section as generously as possible and i'm going to finger detangle i'm not using any combs for this wash day because um i space out my use of combs i use combs like once in three months or so because my hair is really thick and combs sort of distress my hair and hands because it, it, it takes a lot of work to comb my hair with a comb so i literally just finger detangle every wash day until it's time for a comb wash day what you see me doing here now is spraying every section of the hair as generously as possible with the detangling spray and then i go in with my fingers and just you know get out all the knots and tangles as best as possible and then i twist up each section So this detangling spray mixture that I made actually actually really helped with my detangling process. Ordinarily I'd use um V05 conditioner or any conditioner with slip, but this one did the job and this is how much hair I lost. So now I'm going in with my Ziza shampoo and I'm just going to apply it all over my scalp and you know scrub my scalp not scrub but like rub you know try to get all the dirt out of my scalp right and then i'm going in with ziza's exfoliating scalp scrub now i've used this product like three times in the past and i love how it makes my scalp feel purpose of this product is just to exfoliate your scalp pretty much the same way you'd use an exfoliating toner or something on your face yes yeah, so that's what this does to my scalp and you're gonna see i've rinsed it out and my scalp is literally Really glowing now we're going into deep conditioning i'm using the rookie hair care protein conditioner because my hair was really weak and brittle at this point and i felt like i needed you know a pick me up so i just apply that generously to every section keyword generously i slather this product on although there's only so much i could slather because i was almost out and my hair again is really thick but i just try to get as much as possible you know into as many crevices of my hair as possible don't forget your edges don't forget you know your parts you know i i almost always have a, a middle part going on so those parts of your hair that are generally exposed you want to make sure that you're getting them with the conditioner right so i just apply that thoroughly and then i twist it you see this wash day we're working in twist the twist will help to keep my hair from tangling back on itself and knotting you know it just keeps everything nice and pretty so i twist my hair back up and yeah look at that hair wow <laughs> okay so now that we're done applying next step is to cover my head with my plastic cap my shower cap and leave it on for about 30 minutes now everything is rinsed out you see my scalp glowing my hair looks pretty smells amazing <laughs> So yeah, now we're moving into scalp toner. I like to use this every time that I use the exfoliating scalp scrub. It's basically like your face, you know, how you exfoliate and use a toner and all of those things here. Yeah. So I just apply the scalp toner to my scalp and massage it in. Now I'm splitting my hair so I can go in with my leave-in conditioner, which is the Bell Star leave-in conditioner. I apply this guy generously. This guy has actually become a staple in my hair care routine. I always, you know, try to make sure I have at least a bottle of it so now that i've applied my moisturizer i'm going to seal with some castor oil my hair loves jamaican black castor oil next step of course we're going to be twisting my hair back up and then i'm just going to continue the same process for all of my hair until i'm done
now that we're done with the leave-in conditioner and the oil the next step for me is to oil my scalp I do this using the rookie hair care Ayurvedic hair oil and I just apply this generously all over my scalp you know so everything is nice and pretty my scalp is healthy and nourished my hair feels great my scalp feels great I feel great and yeah that's it So this is the time to give your scalp a good massage you know get rid of all the stress that Lagos is causing you <laughs> but yeah just give your scalp a good massage you know it's it's healthy it increases blood flow promotes hair growth all of those things yeah so now we're done we're just admiring our hair and our length So now that we're done with wash day, I went on to style my hair. I put my hair in this pretty hairstyle. It's literally a flat twist in front and my DIY kinky ponytail in the back. I'm going to link the video where I made this ponytail here. And I'm also going to link the video where I put my hair in this hairstyle here as well. So if you want to see that, please click this link. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>